The 12th ranked Tennessee Volunteers lost their first game of the season, losing to Gonzaga 83-74 at the Milk House at Disney's Wide World of Sports Complex in Orlando. 10th ranked Gonzaga featured five scorers in double figures as they win the Old Spice Classic on Sunday night, and it is their first win against Tennessee. In the first five minutes, both teams relied on the three-point shot for success. The Zags connected on their first three shots, but Tennessee answered with Wayne Chisholm and Scotty Hobson. Hobson and Tyler Smith helped the Vols get to a four-point lead with five minutes left, but Gonzaga fought back. The Bulldogs ended the half on a 7-0 run to lead 35-31 at the break. Gonzaga continued playing well early in the second half. Key steals and slams allowed them to take their then-largest lead of seven points with 13 and a half minutes to play. The Bulldogs continued growing the lead throughout the rest of the game. Gonzaga hit 11 three-pointers on the night, shooting 55% from behind the arc. More Tennessee turnovers allowed Gonzaga to grow the lead to 18 with four minutes left, but Tennessee wasn't done yet. The Vols went on a 15-3 scoring run with just under two minutes left to play, and a Cameron Tatum three-pointer cut the lead to six with under a minute and a half to play. Tennessee failed to score on a possession with under a minute to play, and the Zags were able to hit key foul shots, and a Jeremy Pargo slam iced the game as Gonzaga won 83-74. Tyler Smith led the Vols in scoring with 17, and he was joined in double figures by Scotty Hobson and J.P. Prince. While Gonzaga wins this matchup, these two teams will play again this season on January 7th in Knoxville. Tennessee will be back at home Wednesday night, taking on UNC Asheville at Thompson Bowling Arena. The game begins at 7 p.m. and will be televised by Sports South. For UTSports.com, I'm Roger Hoover.